Preparing a report of the project has always been a boring and tiresome task to complete. But there are a few alternatives that can cheer up your mood and you can complete the report and will definitely enjoy it while writing the report. So, today's topic that we will be learning is how to create a weekly project report in Google Docs. Writing a report about the progress of the project is an essential task during the life cycle of the project in the organization. Whenever a project is started, the first thing that is prepared is planning the goals and targets of the project, the budget of the project, the software and technologies that will be used, the contracts and agreements and a lot more things. Thinking of these plan is very easy but implementing them is a difficult task. The weekly report of the project keeps the stakeholders informed about the progress of the project. This report written on a weekly basis of the project gives transparency to the process or to the life cycle of the project. This will also help you to get the issues or problems beforehand. So how this report will be prepared on a weekly basis you must be wondering right? Well there are some simple yet effective alternatives that will help you in preparing the report of the progress of the project. There are some templates already present in Google Docs that will sort out your issue of preparation of report about the progress of the project. The project progress report basically covers the information about the status of the project and the changes that have been done in the project for the stakeholders to understand and have track of the status of the project. Have you ever faced any difficulty while preparing the project progress report? Yes? No? Well, do tell us in the comment section. So, moving ahead with what are the elements or the topics that should be present in the report. The report generally contains the detail about the project the current status of the project, the risk or problem that are present in the project, and the implementation of specific techniques that are needed to clear the issues. The best practices that you can follow to prepare an effective project report are First, a simple format utilization. The report about the progress of the project generally consists of two or three pages. The report should be simple, easy to understand, and should contain brief information that are necessary. The excess information may take most of the time and may create confusion among the people who are reading the report. Second, templates utilization. The use of templates can reduce the consumption of time during the report preparation. It is not necessary to structure a format and use it for report writing. You can have a single template for it and use it whenever you want to prepare the report. Third, the documents involved in the project should be maintained carefully and should be kept up to date. Fourth. The report should not be prepared and submitted at the last minute. It should be prepared beforehand and the details should be updated in it after regular meetings. Fifth, the report prepared must be written in accordance with the viewpoints and ideas of the viewer so that there will be no clashes in the life cycle of the project. As I have mentioned that there are various templates available in the Google Docs for you to prepare the reports. So let's discuss a few templates that will help you in the report making process. First, dynamic progress report template. This template is available in Google for your usage. Also, it is available free of cost. You can open Google Sheets and there you can prepare the report with the help of this template. Some other templates that can help you in report making are Bright Blue Progress Report, Progress Report and Soft Color Project Status Report. Do you know why it is suggested to use Google Docs for creating reports about the status of the project? The reasons behind using Google Sheet for report creation are First, the Google Docs are not just used for report creation but are used for budget preparation, tracking resources, data analysis and a lot more things. Second, the Google Doc offer very simple and effective templates for making of the reports. Third, the improvements to the reports can be done by anyone who has the access to the Google Docs. This can help in framing the report more effectively and in a better way. Fifth and the last, it is free to use. Anyone who is interested in making reports can use the templates and design as it is totally free of cost. I hope today's video will help you to get some knowledge about how to use the Google Docs for the creation of the report on the status of the project. To know more about this topic and project management, please subscribe to our channel to watch new videos daily. Thank you and have a nice day.